Hi, my name is Chris Rupp, and I'm the Curator and Collections Manager here at the Westmont Ridley Tree Museum of Art. And today I get to talk to you about this wonderful print by Carol Wax, which is mezzo tint. And it's one of three mezzo tints in this exhibition of 57 works. Some of you might be asking, what is a mezzo tint? Well, it was an early process that had fallen out of favor when easier methods of printmaking came around, such as lithography where prints could be produced in multiples in vast quantities. Mezzo tent is very laborious. It starts with a copper plate and you have a special tool called a mezzo tent rocker. And this tool actually has a curved blade with hundreds of needles. And you go back and forth and you rock the plate out. When the plate is completely rocked out, if you, run, if you were to ink it and run it through the press, it would print as a solid black field. So in order to get the image, you actually have to go back into that rocked field and start scraping and polishing and burnishing out areas to reveal the whites and the mid-tones of the print. So you can see already how laborious that process is. And Carol Wax is considered one of the main contemporary mezzo tent printers today. She makes really wonderful prints that are visually very exciting, and this print is one of them. In her work, she deals with vintage items, such as typewriters, old machinery, and in this case, she's dealing with vintage fabrics. This print very much relates to the op art movement of the 60s and 70s. It has this really dramatic, bold, zigzag fabric with all these folds really complicated print to create and visually is very exciting to the viewer. It's when you get up close and you really start looking at the print that you see what is under wraps in this print and that's the nose and paw of her dog Cecil who is a Weimariner that are sticking out of the blanket here. Mm -hmm.